By 2030, the world is expected to witness the rollout of 6G technology. IIT Hyderabad, which has already established a 6G testbed and secured critical patents, is working to ensure that India is a key player in shaping the next gen of communication technology. We are more or less prepared for 6G. IIT Hyderabad, at least as far as we are concerned, we have developed the critical patents that are required to be part of 6G, at least the fundamental ones. We have, def we have developed them. The cell phone we use uh, has patents developed from India, from IIT Hyderabad, the companies that are affiliated with this IIT Hyderabad born here, as well as other IITs and other research institutes. They have been made part of this 5G technology. They are used in the phone today. Very few people know about it. But we have some skin in the game in 5G. We'll have more stake in 6G. The jump from 5G to 6G will not just be about speed. Researchers say it will bring a much broader transformation, combining artificial intelligence and machine learning to deliver unique immersive experiences. In 6G, more than the speed, of course there will be more speed, internet speed, which enables new applications. There are going to be two or three new things that will happen. So you will have communication almost anywhere, anytime, land, sea, aeroplane, you will have connectivity. The devices will embrace AI, artificial intelligence and machine learning in the cell phones and devices. The form and shape of the device will change. That means the amount of wireless internet speed you need using a device, you can still call it a smartphone, it can do holograms perhaps, AR, XR, we don't know what it is. So there is so much unknown, we have to be prepared for that. One of the key technologies under development at the Institute is what researchers call full duplex wireless communication, which promises to revolutionize data transmission. So this full duplex wireless communication allows transmission and reception to happen at the same time in the same frequency channel. So effectively this can double the overall throughput whatever we are seeing currently. So if let's say the current uh, operators can support 10 Mbps in a given channel, with the help of full duplex you can theoretically make it close to 20 Mbps in the same uh, same channel bandwidth. The Institute's leadership is fully backing efforts to strengthen India's telecom capabilities in-house. We have been able to develop 5G narrowband IoT chip, which is the first time in the uh, country and also uh, is a leading thing in the world also. Now even we have a 6G testbed also on our campus. So in the 6G also we are taking up leadership. It is uh, uh, still an unknown territory that we are entering into. But then it is important that leaders take up such kind of tasks where you enter into an unknown territory and define the territory by yourself. So I'm sure in the next one or two years we will know more about what kind of uh, opportunities that 6G gives to all of us and some applications will evolve. While many believe that India was late to 4G and only gained ground in 5G, researchers at IIT Hyderabad are determined to ensure that India is at the forefront when 6G rolls out.